Hello, Lego, Lego fans and booster brick enthusiasts. We've come to the point in the story for the February box where it's time for the premiere challenge. And the premiere challenge is to build a laugh factory. The story gives you a little bit of a hint on what it should look like. It's a building, looks like a giant theater of some kind. And it's the Laugh Factory. So, let us open the Premier Challenge pack and see what parts we have to work with. Boom, 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 ba -doom, ba -doom, boom. Here we go. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of parts. Just like with the micro build challenge, you can see it looks like random stuff. You'll find some neat parts. Some of them have stickers on them. Those are pretty fun little butterflies. I bet those are happy butterflies that will help create laughter. Um, some parts that's not a sticker, but it's a print. Not sure what Lego set that was from originally. Um, ooh, this brick has an eye on it. Ooh, that's a fun one. So, there's lots here to choose from. Oh, this one looks like somebody made a calculator on it. Interesting. We are going to go through here. I'm going to sort out the pieces a little bit. Uh, try and come up with a place to start. And then I'll be right back. Okay, I've got all my pieces sorted. And as you can see, there's quite a few of them here. I don't know how many. I did not count them. I'm guessing probably about 200, maybe 250 pieces. I've got a lot of um, the smaller pieces, which I think are going to help make this build very interesting. Uh, I'd like to point out some of the more unusual pieces that came with this this particular challenge pack. This is a tile or plate, I guess, with hinging capabilities, and it's wider than the typical um, hinge tile that we see. And so that's kind of cool. We've got a an angular piece. Could come in handy. This is a connector of some kind. We have the flame piece. I think this was the spotlight challenge from last month's box, if I remember correctly. This is another hinge kind of a piece. This one here. I've seen in a couple of sets, Lego sets, um, similar. I don't know that I've seen this color. This one is a gold uh, cap, I guess. But it's a pretty nice piece. Um, might be able to use that to finish off a portion of our laugh factory. I got a flipper. Uh, this is actually a minifigure part, but never know. Could be able to use that here in the laugh factory. It's so another nice finishing piece. Uh, it's like the apex of a house, I guess, is, is what it would most commonly be used for. And then we've got a lever. And since we are making a factory, I think that's a nice piece to have. All right, now it's time to get building.
Okay, I am done with the Premier Challenge. I did not use all of the bricks, but I did use quite a few. And what I came up with is my Laugh Factory. And so this front view here, you've got the sign with the L for laugh. And this is a stage. The stage is rigged up like nobody's business. Um, and let me tell you why. There's speakers and microphones and uh, teleprompters and video screens all over the place. On the back side, backstage, it's a high-tech laboratory with a chair. And this high-tech lab is to help focus funniness and humor to the person on stage. And the whole, the whole purpose here is to let the jester get their funniness back so that the jester can make people laugh again which is what the jester really wants to do. Um, so you can see computer screens and readouts, and we've got a lever here to go and power up the entire laugh factory. And once that's powered up, all of this kicks into action. And so you've got eyes that watch the person on stage they can give feedback maybe they're not moving around enough um, maybe they're moving around too much uh, so you've got the visual cues this is this is um concentrated humor that can be sh shoop, shot out at the person on stage and we've got the microphones here to pick up what the jester is saying and then it goes back to be analyzed where your your super humor can be adjusted. And then there's um, microphones all throughout to also monitor what the audience thinks and gets their feedback as well. I've got some microphones up here too because sound bounces around quite a bit. Um, I'm looking for my gesture. Oh, there's my gesture. Right. So, upon finding the magical flower and the fairy, now we've got our gesture here at the laugh factory working on getting, getting their ability to make people laugh back. Wish him luck. That's my laugh factory, what I chose to do. How would you build a laugh factory? I'd love to see them.